At the Kiwani Historical Society, we have artifacts, mementos, documents, and photos of Kiwani's past. The story of Boss actually started with Mr. H. H. Perkins, a farmer living southeast of Kiwani, who invented and patented a metal corn husking peg in 1887. He, along with W. H. Lyman, Hiram Lay, and Mr. C. C. Wilson and H. T. Terry formed a small company in 1889 to manufacture them. A few years later, Mr. Perkins left the company and it was incorporated on July 1st 1893 as the Boss Manufacturing Company. Today it's hard to imagine, but back then and through the first half of the 1900s, corn husking was done by hand, not with the big farm machines we see today. Corn husking hooks, pegs, and gloves were an absolute necessity for farmers back then, and Boss was the leading supplier, and the tool that many of the greatest huskers of the day used. Homer Koopman is the first champion of Wisconsin to contend in the national event. There is a knack in knowing how to compete successfully in every contest. Koopman husked seven and 73 one hundredth bushels before the crack of Governor Stark's final gun. Now, most people, when they think about boss, at least in Kiwani, think about gloves. It wasn't long after the company was formed when Mr. Lyman and Lay, who were partners not only in the boss, but in the Kiwani street car system and the town's largest retailer, began to notice that in their store, farm wives were buying significant quantities of Canton flannel in the fall and winter to make gloves and mittens for the farm. And as you can see by this letter, Mr. Lyman and Mr. Lay did their homework. And it wasn't long after that the boss was into gloves in a big way. After 125 years, Boss is still headquartered in Kiwani and continues to distribute a complete line of gloves as well as boots, rainwear, and safety products. Over the years, the Boss grew into the largest glove manufacturer in the world, and as it grew, so did its operations in Kiwani. While the boss headquarters has always been in Kiwani, they have had operations all over the country, as you can see on the right-hand side of this brochure from the 1920s. It wasn't long before boss outgrew their office space and built a new headquarters in downtown Kiwani. They occupied it in March of 1914 and were there in that building for nearly a century. Boss has been an important employer in Kiwani for 125 years. That was the case back in the day and that's still the case today. Here's a photo of Boss's industrial team gathering for a meeting in 2018. And here's a picture of Boss's sales team back from 1925, before anybody ever heard of Business Casual. 
While gloves are still an important product in 2018, the company has expanded into a variety of new products. The Boss Group of Companies today includes Galaxy Balloon, a distributor of specialty promotional products, Boss Pet Products, which is a distributor of pet supplies, Aries Boss Tech Products, which is a distributor of cell phone accessories, and Boss Canada, a distributor of gloves, boots, and rainwear. Boss has been a global licensee of gloves for Caterpillar since 2003, and cat gloves that are supplied by Boss are sold throughout the world. Boss has been a key part of the fabric of Kiwani's history, and it still has a number of long service employees that have seen a good part of that history unfold. It takes great employees like that and a clear focus on satisfying your customers to be in business that long. Congratulations, Boss, on 125 years and counting.